Welcome to another Repairmatic video. In this video, I will talk about how to add Bluetooth in your car. Doesn't matter if you have an aux wire or if you don't have an aux wire, you have an old stereo with only radio, you have the latest stereo, you have built in aux wire in your car. These three methods will fit any car. So, I'll talk about these three FM modulator, Bluetooth to aux, and then another kind of the same bluetooth to aux so maybe two two different ways so these two like uh, this one mini receiver and the bottom one these are kind of the same but uh, they have they are slightly different uh, but same so follow the video till the end and then you can install the bluetooth in any car and i can guarantee any car so the first one is this one maybe most of you already know but uh, for those who don't know this is FM modulator. What it will do is you connect it into your what is it is called cigarette lighter and then you connect your phone via Bluetooth to this module and then you can this module will connect over the radio to your stereo. So yeah. <clears throat> Let's open this one and see what is inside. Make sure to buy a good one, like uh, with, with a good quality. So it's a modulator and then it comes with the with aux wire so what you can also do is uh, you can connect your mobile phone with this aux wire 3.5 millimeter wire from your phone to this module and then this will transmit over the radio to your stereo so yeah <clears throat> what you have to do is uh, put it into your secret lighter and then uh, tune to a frequency FM frequency which is not used by common station like 87.5 101 check in your area the frequency which is free which is not used by major radio stations you need to set this one to that one and then match that same frequency over your stereo let's start so now it is in it says bluetooth I don't know if you can see in the video but it says Bluetooth not connected channel you have to choose now it's 108 so channel for example not 87.5 it asks 107 I haven't seen this stereo using 107 so I can use 107 and then set my stereo tuner to 107 And then you have to go manually to no don't go too fast 107 exactly 107.0 okay so now it's connected to 107.0 now you need uh, now you need a uh, mobile phone and then Turn on your Bluetooth, go to your go to your settings, search for Bluetooth, Bluetooth on. And so now it says uh, whatever it, it says on, on here uh, T11. So I will choose T11 from here. Paired. So then it says paired. And then now I need to play music. I don't have any music in this one so I need to connect this phone to the to the Wi-Fi okay so now my phone is connected through Bluetooth to this device and now this device is connected over the radio 107 to this stereo so now I can play I'll play some Punjabi music Yeah, that's that's quite easy and then if I don't know if you can but you can hear still some noise or um, how do you say yeah some noise over over the channels and the quality because you're connecting this over a over a wireless network which is Bluetooth to your device so some noise and some quality degradation and then that device is connected to modulator is connected to your stereo or a radio and then there is some noise and uh, 
then there is some noise and uh, quality degradation over this uh, thing also so if you want to avoid that what you can do if you still want to use it what you can do is you can connect an aux wire if you don't have a bluetooth in your phone or if you don't want to use bluetooth for some reason you can connect uh, aux wire and then there is a place on this module on the side you can connect aux wire to this one yeah we can So on this side you have an option of so on this side you have an option of uh, micro SD card aux wire and then you can also connect your charging this can also act as a like a car charger and you have two ports yeah so we can we can try to connect the aux wire yeah I have an aux wire here So now I have disconnected the Bluetooth. There is no Bluetooth. It says unconnected. There is no Bluetooth. Now we are playing over the over the aux wire to this module, and then this module is connected to your radio. Yeah. So this was about this module. So now we'll move on to the next module. But next is my kind of favorite this one so this looks pretty solid and the construction is really good let's see it's a bluetooth to aux converter yeah the packing looks quite pretty So pretty solid Bluetooth to aux converter and the Bluetooth is this and then there is a pretty nice solid I think it's gold plated aux converter if it's a aux wire if it's a good one then you have a pretty nice quality and this connects to your charger over the blue uh, over the USB so you don't have to worry about the power it has a built-in mic and you can call and does it say anything else in the advertisement it's uh, I think it says Bluetooth 5 version 5 metal warranty automatic connection good so let so we'll connect it to the car charger like this and we'll connect this wire to your stereo and now we need to connect our mobile phone to this Bluetooth device. Let's see if it shows up here. Go to your Bluetooth menu. So then you go to th your Bluetooth menu and search for a device. It will show up with the name of Base CUS. Here it is. Pairing, connecting connected you you heard some sound go to your bluetooth menu play some other punjabi song let's see <laughs> i can play the previous one but yeah uh, i want to hear this one <laughs> it has this beeping sound okay now it's off so what I want to do now is turn off the car and see if the Bluetooth is still uh, I will also unplug this and connect it again just to see if it automatically connects next time so I don't have to like connect it I'll turn on, off my Bluetooth turn it on it should connect it automatically so when I come into car I should only turn on the Bluetooth and 
it should connect this device automatically as it says okay so now it's connected automatically i don't have to search it and so now it's automatically connected it has power so you can use for as long as you want just turn on your stereo in aux mode you play the music so this one is quite simple it has better quality the device has a better quality so you don't have to exactly look for this one but to look for a good quality Bluetooth it should be called Bluetooth to aux converter for your car so I would recommend this one if your car has an aux aux option if your stereo has an aux option there is an so this is pretty cool and simple simplest I would say simplest method to connect to have Bluetooth in your car if you don't have just need a car car charger connect it here connect the aux there connect your phone to the to this Bluetooth and you have Bluetooth in your phone it's it's also pretty cheap it's not that expensive you don't have to do anything complex yeah simpler solution This one is mini receiver. Yeah. Bluetooth to aux converter. Let's see what is inside the box. You can call, you can listen to music. This one is like you have a receiver and then you have this aux pin, two way double pin. You connect one here, another one goes into your stereo. And this one actually has a uh, built-in, uh, not built-in, it has a battery inside and then it says that you can uh, you can play music for some time, up to 8 hours, which I don't really think, but uh, yeah, it says that. And then you also have this charging wire that you can uh, connect. The problem with this one that I saw on one model is that you have to turn it on every time. And then let's see if it works now better to connect it here connect the power and then you connect the power here yeah and then we connect our mobile phone Bluetooth to this device just to turn it on Power on. Yeah, so now you have to turn it on maybe every time. Some, yeah, new device came up. Let's connect to this one. Connected. Thank you. Yes. Then pick up your song. Let's play a different Punjabi song. I'm also promoting Punjabi music here. <laughs> pause on this button you also have you can pick 
call by pressing this button when you have a call I think uh, I don't have an option to like call right now but I think it says this phone shows this phone button on this one so maybe you get a call you just have to press this button and then you pick up a call this one compared to this one it's more like uh, it takes more area and then it comes in the way but uh, compared to this one this one is pretty sleek so the device actually goes it hides in there and then you just have a cable for, for this one what you can do if you want to hide this thing somewhere in here there's a trick what you can do is you get rid of this thing you get a normal aux wire you connect the aux wire here yeah and then you have this big aux wire you can just hide this thing anywhere inside or wherever you want so you have power or you can hide it in the back of your stereo just get it power from somewhere and then yeah but if you want to have a call like this has a built-in mic so it should be closed by here it shouldn't hide in the glove box it should stay here but if you have a short cable just, just imagine like you hide this one and you just only have one cable going in there that is one way but the cable doesn't come with it so you have to buy it yourself this is another way but I think this is also cool just check the quality if this has a better quality or some other receiver has a better quality so this is Bluetooth to aux converter it says here mini receivers there are many variants of this these things this one and this one there are other many variants so pick the good one I think I would say pick a good quality one with the warranty and then look at the build quality it should be really good because over the Bluetooth over the time you want a good sound if you have good music system in your car you want a good sound but these are like convenience if you want to hear the best music out of your uh, streaming device the aux is the best way connect aux wire directly to your mobile phone and then you will hear the best quality over the bluetooth you would lose some quality but it's convenience i would prefer that i don't want to connect the cable every time to your phone that can also uh, what is the word uh, de de destroys the quality of your aux pin in your mobile phone also or if you have any other thing like i have this converter usb c to 3.5 mm converter and this this is not a very good quality every time you you sit in your car you have to connect it to the phone and then maybe it can destroy your your ports so yeah these are the ways this can work with any car if you don't have an aux wire aux location on your on your stereo maybe you have an aux location in your car somewhere in the glove box somewhere here that would make it more clean and sleek you take the power connect your device somewhere here and then connect the aux wire to that location whichever in your car it comes with the Ford Focus and some other cars if it, it's not directly in the stereo it is somewhere in your car so that is more clean I would think so yeah like share subscribe my channel for more car videos and videos about these kind of simple things some people don't know even about the simple FM modulator but uh, they ask me questions like how do we have bluetooth in your car in their car so thank you for having patience watching my videos and good luck have a nice day bye